The boy moved like a shadow, a piece of the night broken off and slinking across the city. He melted seamlessly from one darkened corner to the next, untouched by the guttering orange light that danced in the glowing skulls of the street lamps. It was not only his familiarity with the streets of London that allowed him to disappear so completely within its sooty labyrinth. He felt the tingling sensation within his body, the many points at which he could connect to the light and the darkness, twitching and coaxing them like cloaks on strings, drawing them closer, wrapping himself in them, or else casting them away. This was his gift. This, he knew, was why he was chosen. It was a heretical thought. He thought it anyway, and grinned for good measure. At the end of the cobbled road down which he now travelled, the fences of the bright Teritum rose up, like so many arrows aimed at the sky. Every few minutes, the boy reached into his pocket and felt for the note wrapping his fingers around it, running his thumb over its rough surface. He imagined it was a talisman meant to bring him luck, and luck he would need, that if nothing else was certain.